All right, YouTube. This is a little car I bought. Five series. BMW. Uh, mint in inside. Uh, the battery is disconnected, but it's got 110,000 miles. The seats are pretty new, no rips, no tears. Show you the back. Brand no no no. Uh, we're working on this. We bought it for nine hundred. Doing the body work over here. It's not that bad a body work. It's just that line right there. We gotta smash it. All right, here's what we're doing, YouTube. Uh, this is the BMW we're working on, and there's no more brakes. There's no more uh, brake pad left. There's about 5% left, so we got these bad boys. Brand new. Mm -hmm. Yummy. And we're going to throw them on. We got it jacked up already. So we're going to put the brake. The brakes are... Horrible. Barely stopping, so we're gonna fix everything. This is a nice car. Uh, but we're doing a little uh, project because we're bored. As I showed you the bodywork before, mine here, our little invention over here. We uh, put the come along chain, a big chain, and hooked it up right about here and come along. We come along it all out. It was all the way in the trunk. It was like to here. So we bring it all the way back out. So the trunk could. Uh... Alright, we just now took off the caliber. caliber. It's right over here. Pretty easy. Just two little pins. This is the old one. Hold up the new one, Tom. Right beside it. That's what it's supposed to look like, but Here's there's no the more pad. There's no more pad left. It's gone. <laughs> oh my goodness. So, we're putting new ones on. We'll come back and show you. Alright. Every time you do change brake pads, guys, show them the clamp. You need the clamp, because you ain't going to change the no brakes at all. We'll tell them why. Cause when you run up, when you have brake wear, the caliber pushes it on itself. So your the old the wear brake could follow through and you see that make it right stop. There? You gotta squeeze that in. Is it squeezing? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. There's a cylinder right there. And it's out. And when the brake pad wears, it goes more and more out. And when you gotta put the new brake pad, it's fatter. You gotta squeeze it in. This Very way, simple. this way, it catches the rotor. And when you change it, when you put new brake shoes on, it's not gonna fit on the rotor because it's gonna be too fat. So this is how you do it. Done. The clamp is seven bucks. Get the job done. We'll you, show it to you when it's all back. You ain't changing no brakes, even on a little Ford Escort without it. Yep. All right, guys. Yeah, try it one more. Go. That's it. That's it. We got the come-alongs and the tools and the drills and the everythings. Here's the bumpers. We're using the go-kart as a put our parts in. That's right, shovel. And that's about it. We just gotta straighten out this uh, trunk and uh, 
This car is worth about a million. So that's about it, guys. This is my BMW 5 Series for sale. Whoever wants to buy it, dig damage. Well, it looks bad right now, but I'm going to show a video when it's all done and show you how I work right now. So I'm going to be putting up a video pretty soon of us pulling all this out. So, God bless.